will completely put out their vinyl because they just wrote a point. I know, I know, I know. Me, me, me. Oh, hi there, Miss Day. Today's February 10th, 2020. And you know what that means? From here are some ways you can celebrate Valentine's Day. That's why right, here today we have. Clean the blood. To show us what we can do on a day like Valentine's Day. Hey there, DSA. I'm Kamala Melendez, and I'll be a very special reporter for today. Valentine's Day is just around the corner, and just in case you don't know where to go or what to give, here are some ideas for you. I know that finding a Valentine's gift or even a place to go might be hard, but there are plenty of ideas for you to use. If you have a Valentine's, I would suggest going to the movies with your significant other or your friends. Valentine's Day doesn't have to be all about romance or spending money on places you can't afford. If you do want to spend your Valentine's Day with your significant other, you could go to an arcade or to your favorite fast food. I suggest Chick-fil-A because it's just the best. Going out to places isn't the only thing you can do on Valentine's Day. You can always stay home and set up a romantic dinner for your partner. Finding something to give someone? I got you covered. Roses are cute and simple, but adding a bit of sweetness will definitely top off your gift. Something like chocolate or their favorite candy might just be the sweetness you're looking for. You can also add a teddy bear or something extra to make your present a little better. I hope this helped and I hope you have a happy Valentine's Day full of joy and sweetness. I'm Kamil Melendez signing off from Create TV. Hope to see you again with more exciting information. Thanks, Camila. That really made me think differently about Valentine's Day. What do you think, Isabella? Yeah, that really changed my mind about my Valentine's. So I can spend it with my friends and family. That was